Hey, what up decisive marketers? One of the best ways that you can use to capture more leads or to improve the interactivity on your website is to make use of quizzes, right? So today's two is actually a WordPress plugin. So for you WordPress geeks out there, this is the tool that you want to check out. Today's tool is called Smart Quiz Builder. And you can use Smart Quiz Builder to create personality quizzes, product recommendation, uh, lead magnet quizzes, or BuzzFeed style quiz, assessments, scoring, surveys, and calculators as well. Now, before we get started, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content. Right, so, uh, so here we go. Right, so this is uh, Smart Quiz Builder. They have a couple of um, demos right here. Right, so uh, on their website, so you can check it out. Uh, these are some of the uh, product recommendation demo. So what happens is that you can ask people uh, what kind of causes. It will be more suitable for them uh, by taking this quiz. You can also uh, do a lead magnet quiz uh, on the website as well. Let me try and refresh this so and see if it works. Let me see. Okay, so this is how it works, right? So before you even let them sign up, you can ask them a series of questions. So this way, it can actually help you to filter some of the you know audiences that you don't want while at the same time uh i feel that you can capture better better and more leads with this right so for example if you click on this uh it asks you where do you hear about this cause uh, are you willing to put in the effort uh yes uh, what's the biggest challenge right are you familiar with this uh i'm going to show you how i build a cause do you have a Site web, uh, you have a website right right now, okay. And what are the main challenges that you face? Okay, so I'm sorry about that. Just give me, just let me mute, mute some of this stuff right here. Okay, so it says what are the main challenges you are facing right now, and then you can fill in, and then it will then let you sign up, right? So this is, you know, uh, I think a very good way uh, for you to make use of this. Um, this is a personality quiz that you can click on, right? So where do you eat your lunch? Where do you start your work day? Where do you end, right? And then you fill it up and then uh, you will then reach a lead capture before the results are actually shown to you, right? So that's the cool thing about making use of uh, Smart Quiz Builder. So here we are in the Smart Quiz Builder um, dashboard right here. So I have actually created a quiz. Um, creating a quiz is very similar to you know editing a quiz. So um, first thing I usually like to jump into the settings first before I do anything, right? So these are the quiz settings. Do you want to ask the name? Uh, this this is actually asking uh, the name first so that uh, it, it captures a name and you can personalize the questions uh, as you go along right uh, and then are the questions random are the answers random so do you want to change the order of the questions or the answers so every time they take it's a different uh, question or answer and then you want to give uh, points when they add so this one is actually uh, you got to use an add-on right which is uh, the they have another plugin by the same company right here uh, it's called game of points right so if you have um, game of points then you would then be able to assign uh, points to their membership right so they have a quiz category as well so you can set up your quiz categories if you have multiple quizzes on your website and uh, global settings so do you want to disable WordPress sync okay so this is more like uh, has to do with your database okay and then uh, there's also social share uh, sorry my bad we've got a few couple of tabs right here that we can toggle into 
so uh, you've got notifications here so whenever you have a completed quiz you can receive an email right so then uh, you have uh, notifications coming in you've got tracking as well so you can insert your Facebook pixel ID and then uh, this is uh, Facebook uh, I think this might be let's see right this might be face oh okay this is actually for i think facebook login right this is actually for like social login something like that and then uh this is for you to customize the quiz uh you know how it looks like and then you want to enable gdpr so, so then you will add a checkbox for them before the submit okay and then uh, message customizer so whenever there are errors or whatever it is it will show a message in there okay so uh, the first thing we're going to jump in is to the manage quizzes okay so this is how it looks like okay so when you create a quiz this is how it looks like uh, so I've created a quiz right here is uh, how much of an LTD addict are you so there's a LTD edit quiz is a personality quiz and then once you're done you can go to next and then the display settings do you want to embed it or do you want it to pop up right and then all is a bottom right pop up where it shows up right here so you can set that up or you can change uh, the pop up position as well so I'm going to be using pop up right here and then do you want to show progress bar do you want to allow users to retake the quiz Right, how many retake attempts are allowed? Okay, and then do you want to display an opt in form? And where should your where should the users be added? So, uh, if they submit, then I guess it will be creating a user account uh, on WordPress, but uh, you can also then send them to your email platform, which they have all these uh, integrations right here. Uh, active campaign, Aweber, Mailchimp, ConvertKit, Drip, Send in Blue, Get Response, Miller Lite, Fluent, Fluent CRM, and uh, MailPoet. Right. They also have Zapier, Integrately, and Pebbly Connect. Okay. So uh, they already have Pebbly Connect, so that's nice. They've got Webhook as well. Right. Okay. And uh, next button. If you want, if you want to display next button, so that means they can, you can allow them to skip the questions, right? And then you want to set a timer for the quiz, okay? And then once you're done, you can switch over to the next one. This is the start page, how it looks like, meaning the pop up. So you can actually adjust the uh, design um, of the pop up right here, right? You can add shadows, um, you can add video as well. Um, if you want to put a video in here. And then there's a button customizer. You can change the color of the button, okay? And uh, this this is how it looks like, right? So this is what I've added. And then uh, you can change. Uh, you can also design it for mobile as well. So you can show a different design of mobile if you want to, okay? So I'm not gonna not gonna do that for now. And then you've got your outcome, right? So I've created four outcomes here. Uh, the outcome one is your total addict. Outcome 2, you are casuals, right? Uh, outcome 3, you are investor. Outcome 4, you are clueless, right? So what the heck even is LTD and why am I taking this quiz? Okay, that's what's going on in your mind right now. Okay, so that's the outcome. And you can set some uh, redirect rules uh, where you want to redirect the users uh, to. And uh, outcome text. So you, uh, you can add, you can tag people uh, as well. Um, I believe this text could be added to your uh, CRM integration as well and then uh, show other outcomes okay so what to display other outcomes type that is okay so that means you can show them like this is uh, your personality but you can uh, you are also close to this other one or two out, uh, outcomes as well so you can show other outcomes as well so uh, and then you can add the questions in here so uh, my question number one is where do you buy your LTDs and then these are some of the websites and then question two would be how much do you spend money on LTDs and question three would be how much is your total spend on LTDs okay uh, 
and then uh, we can preview the quiz right so this is how it looks like okay so this is how it looks like you can click take a quiz okay so one thing about um, <coughs> smart quiz builder is that you realize that the it loads fast right so when you click on the button it goes to the next one it loads very quickly so uh, enter any additional information about the quiz you can pick uh, whichever so if you buy from everything you can just click <coughs> everything and how, uh, how much do you spend okay just click one of this and then uh, any information about the quiz okay so let's say I have this value of LTVs okay then you can just put in your email Okay. okay my apologies on this let me just get rid of that and once you enter it in it will show you your result right here All right so your result type is investor okay then you can retake if you want to okay so uh, this is how it looks like and you can also uh, open branching so uh, where the next question depends on that means you have a sort of like a conditional logic um, right here right and then you can rearrange the questions if you want to right so once you're done you can go to lead generation so this is where you have your form right here right so uh, so they have a quick email verification dot com uh, integration so you can make use of this if you want to okay right so uh, you can also have a HTML form integration that means you can sort of uh, embed this sorry you can you can uh, if it doesn't integrate with any of your CRM tools you can then uh, turn this on and cop and paste the HTML form in there right uh, to create your you have your own form in here and then uh, you have your short code so you can just uh, copy this and paste it somewhere and one thing cool about smart quiz builder is that you can even publish this on a different website that you don't have smart quiz builder installed on right so you can click on the embed code so you can use this and you can actually embed the uh, quiz on a different website and uh, what to add branching logic okay so this was the branching logic earlier and all your uh, leads will then come in here right so all your leads will be saved in here uh, you know you can manage your your leads and your question uh, data question and answer data how many people viewed how many people answered a question okay and you can also set up quiz funnel this will be some uh, kind of like your uh, branching logic okay where you can have uh, this one to here this one to here as well this one to here okay okay and then the rest of the questions go to this one okay so let's see this question allows user to pick multiple answer choices in this type of question okay so this one doesn't work right because um, it's a multiple choice question it has to be like a single choice sort of multiple uh, you can't select multiple items but you know select one kind of choice then you'll be able to send these ones to this question something like that okay so uh, let's see and, and uh, lastly would be the social share so you can actually uh, share your quizzes right so once you have your um, social share uh, you know your Facebook app created you can then uh, you know select your quiz put in the title this is ex and then your images right uh, your share button the outcome outcome and uh, the URL that, that they will be sent to right so this uh, this will be very similar to those uh, BuzzFeed personality quizzes that you have done okay so that's uh, pretty much what smart quiz builder is about um, I think that it seems to do the job that it is set out to do 
um, uh, my bad. There's actually a button here where it shows the Facebook share example. So, uh, this is you, and then this is how it looks like. Okay, right. That's your open graph uh, text in there. So pretty much that's what uh, Smart Quiz Builder does. I think it does the job. Um, I think it's a good solution as well. Um, if you you know like to build your quizzes on WordPress, and one thing really cool about Smart Quiz Builder is that you can also embed your quizzes on a different website. So it's not just limited to your website only. Okay. Um, I I think overall I would rate that this this tool it's it's a worthy tool right if you want to capture more leads it's a it's a good option and I think pretty much that's all I have to say about Smart Quiz Builder um if you enjoyed this video please um give do give me a thumbs up if you know anyone who could benefit from Smart Quiz Builder right be sure to share this video with them and lastly if you know uh if you uh let me know what you think about Smart Quiz Builder in the comments below and that's all I have I'll see you in my next video.